My beloved people of God, I greet you all in the holy name of our Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ. Jesus meets YouTube families, GPS Robbins and Facebook families. I just praise God for you. Every day, God is graciously leading us and every morning, His grace is new. Even today, the word which comes to you, just hold on to the word. Take those verses and pray with that and apply those verses in your life every day. Every day with Holy Spirit, when you're traveling with Him, you will receive a new experience from Him. Let's go to the Word of God. Genesis chapter 2 and verses 10. Now a river went out of Eden to water the garden. And from there, it parted and became four river heads. Let me read Genesis chapter 2 and verses 11. The name of the first is Pishon. It is the one which skirts the whole land of Havilah where there is gold. My dear people of God, one thing you must know. In Bible, there are some things which we can take literally. And we need to see those literal things in a spiritual light. According to that, in this verse, I'm going to see in a spiritual way. The Bible says, Now a river went out of Eden to water the garden. A river can also be seen as the Holy Spirit in John chapter 7, verses 38 and 39. And Jesus handled in that way. And the Holy Spirit is identified as a river also. It will flow rapidly. Wherever the river flows, the villages, cities and towns will be so prosperous. Yes, my dear people of God, when you're dependent upon the Holy Spirit, when you hear the voice of the Holy Spirit and pray unto Him, the Spirit of the Lord will miraculously guide you, lead you. He is the one who is speaking to you. There's one more thing which I need to tell you. Children of God, in that river, there is gold. There is gold. This denotes riches and blessings. But other side, in 1 Peter 1 verses 7, the gold also denotes faith. The Bible says, a precious faith. So, children of God, the anointing which is like a river which flows into you, two things happen. One thing, you will prosper in your financial aspect. Another way, you will grow in your faith. What a great gladness it brings you, right? So take this verse and just go into the anointing and pray continuously. You will chase the poverty from your life. You will live a life without debt. And God will open new doors for you. Another side, your faith will overcome the world. You will become warriors in faith. This is the beautiful thing that the Spirit of the Lord does in our lives. So you just believe it. You pray along with me. I want to pray for you. Pray for your family. Shall we pray? Just hold on to this word and pray. A loving Heavenly Father, Lord, there is a river, as the psalmist says, Lord. In Genesis, we read in 2 verses 10, Lord, a river went out of Eden. In John 7, we read that the river is the Holy Spirit, Lord. Even now, as your children pray along with me, let the river named anointing flow into their life. In the name of Jesus, let miracles happen, Lord. One side, let there be financial prosperity. Another side, let them grow in faith. Let them become best in faith, Lord. We commit them into your loving hand. Thank you for hearing these prayers. Thank you for doing it so. We thank you for that, Lord. In the name of Jesus, we pray. Amen. Children of God, the word of God will bring forth light into our life. Just remember the light that God gave you today and praise Him. 
and don't forget to share this message to many other people let them be blessed like you you will become so generously and you will thrive in every way we'll see you again god bless you our address jesus meets ministries number 4 kavarapalayam main road abadi chennai 54 india telephone number 9841252836 Seven two double nine five four six three six three. Email ID: gpsrobinson at hotmail dot com. gps dot office at jesusmeets dot org. Website address: www dot gpsrobinson dot org.